in. We're heading over to Catalina State Park. I'm excited. It's had some good hikes. And yeah, the bike yeah, path. It'll be really nice to be in the state park. So um, we met Linda and JP um, for lunch yesterday. It was so fun. They're great. They're awesome. These are real bike people. Oh my gosh. So it's so funny because <laughs> they they're like big bikers that are now doing a hiking trip. And we are now doing the biking trip. So they gave us a lot of great information. And it's just fun. They're just fun. And they told us this better way to get to this Catalina, which I'm really glad because we don't have to go all the way through town because it's so busy. So anyway, we'll see you. Uh, We'll let you know. We'll take you with us on some, on some hikes over here at the at bike from the Catalina. I'm yeah, excited. This, this is supposed to be a really great state park. Yeah. Hiking trails. You can bike from there. There's water. And, well, like water you can hike to. You know, yeah. The lake. Fun. All right. We'll check in later, people. Get outside. Get out there and have some fun. All right. Okay. Bye. So we're rolling along in a little... The overhead info signs. Yeah, the information said wrong wrong way driver ahead. <laughs> we're like, what? So now we're like, huh. So there's a bunch of people ahead of us. So I'm assuming that they'll stop if there's somebody coming the wrong way. I mean, we're good. I don't even know what to look for. But oh my gosh, that's, that's the first, the first time first, I've ever seen that. That's the first time on the highway signs I've ever seen that. <sighs> Usually it's an amber alert or a silver alert. Wrong way driver ahead. Here's our campsite at Catalina State Park. Look, it's just beautiful. Love it. So we are leaving our campsite. And we're going to go hike to the Romero Canyon Trail out of the can out of this Catalina State Park. And our friend Susie and Betsy are with us. So we're going to go check it out. Okay, take you with. So of all the trails we've ever done, we have never seen a sunscreen dispenser at a trailhead.
We're leaving Catalina State Park. Ah, notice We're, my new accoutrement. The de brim. We're going to head down the Oral Valley bike path to the loop. <laughs> so we're going to check it out. It's a nice warm day and it's going to be fun. Gorgeous Susie day. and uh, Betsy are with us. All right, check in later. That makes sense. Oh, okay. Um, see this right here? It's called the Debrim. And it's a sunshade for our bike helmets. So that's what it looks like uh, when it's on. So there's a net. Yeah, here's my. I, I wore it today. It worked great. Yeah. Uh, it's really nice to not have sun on your face. And, and I, um, even with your sunglasses on, it, you squint a lot. Yeah. It really helps. I really, I think I, I think I like it. Yeah, it's full sun out here. So yeah. it's great to. You might risk looking a little dweeby, but hey, I'm past it. Looks like the, <laughs> looks like a pesky biker. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. All right, all right. We'll let you know how we like them. I haven't tried mine yet. I couldn't get it on, but I'll try next time. All right. <laughs> 